I think it's fair to say that a competitive Formula One team couldn't really operate without a strong network of technical partners. There's so many things we do where we don't have the in-house expertise to be able to uh, develop particular solutions where we need to look to our partners to help us out with that and where we hope in return that we can provide an interesting development environment for, for, for their technology so that the, the relationship is genuinely two-way but uh, many many areas where where we couldn't put a competitive car on the grid without their help. 3D Systems are one of the technical partners we've had for many years uh, here at Enstone. Um, they're also one of the most strategic technical partners we have. Um, aero, downforce, uh, optimizing the aerodynamic efficiency of the car, everybody knows that's one of the really fundamental things to making a fast car. And for, I would guess, about the last 10, 12 years, um, a key technology in making a productive wind tunnel program is the, uh, the use of rapid prototyping technology, something which 3D Systems is uh, an absolutely unacknowledged uh, expert in the field of. Additive manufacturing technologies such as selective laser sintering and stereolithography will feature heavily in the future of Lotus Renault GP team. Um, the ability to produce parts quickly and accurately um, have already proven themselves to be incredibly valuable assets in uh, the wind tunnel program um, and have assisted us in producing numerous parts to assess geometrical iterations. What I find particularly exciting is as we move into the realms of rapid manufacturing and that's producing parts directly for the racing car. So as we continue to develop processes and continue to develop materials to allow this to happen, it, it allows the designers to no longer be constrained in the ways that conventional machining processes may, and also enhances the functionality of the part itself. All of that allows our car to remain competitive at the track. By working closely in partnership with 3D Systems, we're looking to push the boundaries of the technology further and further. So the ADM department at Lotus Renault GP manufactures test components for the wind tunnel model. The more tests we can do per day, then the more improvement we see on the track. Um, our development with the program with 3D Systems has been invaluable in this. Uh, we certainly wouldn't be able to manufacture the number of components to the complexity levels that we do using stereolithography at this time. We also manufacture some very complex, high detail casting patterns for titanium parts. Um, these allow us a quick turnaround and enables to change the component very quickly throughout the course of the season. Um, this is invaluable for us over the years, producing small components such as this right up to our gearbox main case uh, with a three day lead time and pattern time. Um, this again has proved invaluable and we're literally allowed to make a change for the part per race if required.